As art galleries and museums remained closed still, the industry has kept going throughout. Artists in Lincolnshire say that lockdown was a blessing in disguise and the best thing that's happened for their work. Illustration artist Mel Langton was given a chance to work on her art full-time after implications with her day job. I was made redundant from my day job, so now this is my full-time job. Um, so it's been a really weird thing. It's been a, it's been a strange sort of process from... from I've kind of got to the place I wanted to be, but in a really weird way that I hadn't expected. Despite her anxiety, Mel has painted an imp for the forthcoming Lincoln Imps trial and is hoping it continues to go ahead this year. Landscape artist Sarah Watson said even though lockdown was complicated, it was full of positives, making herself and her art class work differently. Their work just got amazing. You know, there was so much um, improvement because people were able to focus because they didn't have life getting in the way um, and they were able to devote themselves to their art. So that was incredibly inspiring. Sarah's lessons moved entirely online and as she had no issue in childcare, she was more inspired to work. The classes had provided a steady income and support from the government helped her situation enormously. The third lockdown will test artists in Lincolnshire who have coped well during the first and second lockdowns and found innovative ways to keep up their trade. They'll have to keep adapting to make sure their work and their galleries open to the public in the near future. I'm Katie Smith, LSJ News.